In that scenario, I will not last long. It's worth looking for the remains of the ship food. And even better if you can find weapons and medicines. Seems the costume's energy is coming to an end. And oxygen is not enough for a long time. Hmm. When I fell, I saw an old rover nearby. There could be oxygen tanks and batteries. You can make the batteries on your own. It remains just to find the Niberia. I recall that on the rover map, the nearest field was marked near a large rosewood.
I feel like a damn gnome. If not for the recent event, the successful extraction of an extraterrestrial element could be reason for the party. <laughs> now I have an idea. I have the possibility to create batteries. The onboard computer found a nearby mini station. Apparently, our predecessors are based on it. Or were based. Anyway, it's worth going there right now. Find out the details on the spot. Not a soul.
There is no one left here either, but it's full of dust and trash. It seems that the base has been abandoned for a long time. You need to check the computer. The installation of the Raider station was completely successful. All equipment is connected and working properly. I sent station coordinates and cipher in a separate file. Leading engineer of the YR group, Konstantin Devyatkin. Not bad. If the Raider has survived, I can get the coordinates of other objects built by the first colony. The station has not been visited for a long time. However, all the devices are operational.
Now I can go to the base and find out why they don't get in touch. It's very dangerous here at night. It's not known what creatures the dust of this alien world is fraught with. We need to get to the base as soon as possible.
I'll try to make ammunition. I think a workbench is suitable for this purpose. 